Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another world hunt with me, Richie. Right, we're going to mix it up a little bit when it comes to world hunts at the moment. And we're going to look at some world notes. So I bought this pack of 50 notes online. Um, I think I paid about £14 for them. So there's 50 different notes in here. Um, I haven't had a good look in them yet. So I don't know what really what's in there. But the seller gave me free gift as well. So it looks like there's about three, maybe four notes in this. So we're going to start off in here and see what we have. So I can see it says 5,000 denara there. And it looks, could be Greek. So we're going to have a look and see what we've got in here. So it looks to be about three or four notes. Now let's just put that there. I'm going to spend like 10 minutes or so looking at these. So this is our first one. So it's a, what is it, 50,000 denara. So it does look Greek from the way the writing is. So if I've got that wrong guys, you know what to do in the comments. So yeah, you can see here you've got a little boy. I have no idea who that is. Um, there's another nice detailing. There is a watermark here and it's just basically him looking back this way. Then on this side, we can see there's some flowers, looks like two roses. And then we've got the 50,000 again. You know what, I'm gonna actually use Google Lens and the translate to actually work out what that is. So if I just pop my phone out the camera, uh, pop my phone out the camera, pop my phone out of the thingy, And let's see if it, it says Serbian. So it's translating, now it's telling me a different language, auto-detect, Yugoslavia. So it's not Greek, it's Yugoslavian. There we go. Yugoslavia always gets me. So yeah, pretty cool little note there. It's quite big actually. Then we also, so it's three notes we got as a three gifts. So this one here, I know this one's Russian. <laughs> um, looks like 50 rubles. No. There, so you can see, I'm not sure who that is. Um, but yeah, it's a dude. Mm. <laughs> so, it's a pretty cool note. It's green, it's got the 50 in the background, lots of um, information on the front. And then on the back, a cool building, could be a Kremlin, maybe somewhere in that area. And the water, watermark that's here is just basically that picture there. So we've got a 25, so we've got 1961 there. Is there a date in this one? Is it dated? It looks like the same period, but we got this one here as well, 25, then on the back doesn't have the any, any real pictures or anything, but still pretty cool little thing to have, it's got the CCP on the top there, so that one is during the Cold War, right. So we're going to look into this right here, see what's in here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some couple out and we'll have a look. There we go. How many have we got there? Quite a few actually. Right. So. Got this one here. Let's see if there's just any markings. This one looks Korean. I'm <laughs> just saying, it looks Korean, you can see here, I'm guessing this is the back, 
you got like a village picture here. You got five thousand there. Then obviously the information on there. So I will say, where are we? Yep, Korean. Pretty cool though. Now this one, I know this one. This design, this is from Croatia. This one here is one of something. And there's the back. So obviously I will do more detailed videos of each one of them. And then in the descriptions I'll put more um, information. Oh cool. This one's from Egypt. How cool is that? So there's a mask here on the front, all the information. Let's just see if Google Translate can translate any of it. So mother oh the bank is the airport center. Okay, Google. <laughs> uh, does it have a watermark? It does. It's a pharaoh. The watermark. Here is an Egyptian pharaoh. Sorry, I don't have any information about that. Yeah, because I said the G word. <laughs> right, so and then on the back here you can see there's some like hieroglyphs in the back here. Very, very cool note. Right, this one, Madagascar. Got a Madagascan one here, 20 Arori, I can't pronounce it, so what's this on the picture? It's like some sculptures on the picture there. The water mark that's here is a water buffalo or some kind of buffalo. And then on this side, you can see there's a hut. There's the actual Madagascar Island. And what you did it say? This is a. It's got 1,000 francs. Is it me or is it turning up? Hmm. Kind of bending under maybe the heat of my hand. What year is this one issued? Can't see. Right, this one, I think this is Kazakhstan. I do have. You, I think I have the pink and there's like a blue one of these as well so if I remember right this could be Kazakhstan maybe I'm not too sure but yeah that's just a simple note with an eagle in the center with obviously information around the, the watermark looks to be a let me show you, like a flower in the background. Why is my flash not coming? Flashlight not coming on. There we go. So the watermark, I don't know if you can see it. Looks to be like a massive flower. So here we have our next one. It's 1000 dong. And this is from Vietnam. Some reason these notes look at that I don't know if you can see it it's actually curling I don't know if it's because of the heat of my hand now on the back here you can see we've got an elephant pulling logs pretty cool is there a watermark or is that just the design no that's just the design there so there isn't no watermark on that one there so we've got the next one here, one rupee. This is from India. Yeah, I think this is Indian. Ah, it says India on it. Of course it's Indian. So you can see here we've got, it's like the one rupee coin. They've put it up here as well. Then on the back here you've got an oil rig. And lots of information there. And then you've got government of India. And the watermark, I don't know if you guys can see it is the free lions there so it's basically the watermark is that picture there 
Close the door. So we got three. It looks like Monopoly money. <laughs> oh, that's so bad. I shouldn't say that. Right, let's go back to Google Lens. And see if we can translate anything here. Is Google gonna understand any of this? Maybe I'm going the wrong way around. Just give us an idea. Tap the shutter button to search. No, because we need to use them. So I've got an S. Auto detect. Google, come on, don't let me down. Mongolia. So, according to Google, that sense Mongolia. So these are three Mongolian notes. So we start with this one here. So you can see it's actually different orientation to what we have in the UK. And on the back there, you can see there's some guys riding horses. And on the front as well. I'm guessing that's the front. It's the only side with a serial number. Again here, same orator orientation. Need to learn to speak. And again we've got two guys on the back. Not sure what they're doing there. If you know what they're doing, leave it in the comments. And that's a 20, so we've got the 50 and the 20. And then we have 10 with a couple of archers there. And then there's the other side. So that's pretty cool. Right. So I think this is another Croatian note. So it's got two. I'm not sure what the denomination is called. Um, got two in three places. Then we got a king on that side. Then we have a grand, probably a palace on this side as well with a serial number. Actually, a really nice looking note. And then this is our final one. So, where are you going to be from? Let's get to see if there's any clues before I use the lens. So, you can see there's like ballet on this side and then on this side we've got a nice looking building so let's see if Google I'm not gonna say it out loud Belarus pretty cool so it's got like a nice greenish tint to it as well with the ballet in this side not bad at all so guys that's our first part of our international banknote hunt so how many do we do we look through we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen fifteen countries ish more like 13 or something like that so what I'm going to do is to make sure I don't do them again I'm going to put them in the free gift bag and then in the next video we will go through this one and see what else we can find probably take like 10 notes or so out of there and have a look so guys thank you very very much for taking the time to watch this video I do appreciate it. The Korean note is too big to go in. Typical. Right guys, yeah, I do appreciate it. Thank and again thank you very very much for watching and I will see you in the next one. So take care guys and keep spoiling safe and I'll see you later. Goodbye.